Are you ready for some creative Christmas photography that you also can try at home? You are ready? Well, let's go. All right, now for the first one, we're gonna do a themed freeze motion shot. Uh, so for this, we had a bunch of Christmas gear, uh, like Christmas tree in the back, some gift wrapping paper, uh, and then some candy canes. And then the next step is to get a really fast camera. So when you drop the cookie or whatever into the milk, it can freeze the motion. So for this, we use the iPhone, but you could also use a Canon. And this is what you come up with. Jeez, I just I love this shot. All right, now for the next one, we're gonna do some, uh, some long exposure trickery. Now for this, you're gonna set your exposure to six or seven seconds, and then when the shutter releases, you are going to zoom in. Now this is what it normally looks like um, in just in camera, but when you do this trick, this is what it's gonna come out with. Love it. And depending on how much you zoom, the light streaks just get longer and longer. All right, now for the next shot, we're also gonna do a, uh, a long exposure photo of the Christmas tree. Now for this, they do have a mechanical tree spinner, but uh, I just put it on a rotating wood plate and spin it around, and this is what I came up with. Jeez, I love it. This was also about six seconds shutter. All right, now for the last one, if you got a cute dog, just put him in the middle of a bunch of Christmas lights, have some Christmas lights in the background to add some bokeh, have a super fast camera, because dog photography, you have to be quick, and boom, look at that model. Blue steel, gotta love it. All right, and that is it. That's all I have for today's video. It was a blast doing this. Thank you so much for watching, especially you to the end. I appreciate you. If you have any questions, throw them in the comment section down below, and I will see you next time. Peace.